Fairfax County Public Schools updating its grading policy just as students return to the classroom. They say the newest policy reflects student input. It ultimately changes how students are graded if they don't turn in assignments at all. Our Tisha Lewis joining us live from Falls Church with more details. Tisha, you've been following this one closely. Absolutely, and the big takeaway here is that teachers may now give zeros, yes, a zero grade for students who do not turn in assignments. Previously, it was a 50% grade. That information coming from the folks here at Fairfax County Public School Headquarters. And it is the updated grading policy that was released. We're told students who make a reasonable effort to finish an assignment will get a minimum grade of 50 percent. Fairfax County Public School says the changes were based on input from students and teachers and parents and more. FCPS saying its late work policy will remain the same, meaning students can turn in major assignments up to two weeks late. The school district going on to say the maximum penalty for work turned in late is a 10% deduction, trying to find balance there between accountability and flexibility. FCPS asserting that a rolling gradebook gives students, quote, more chances to show they understand material. FCPS says teachers who use the so-called rolling gradebook must use reassessment and grading replacement practices. It's always been um, something that we've struggled with. But in today's world, where we're needing to help our kids learn accountability, better because uh, unfortunately, you know, we used to give participation prizes for showing up at soccer, right? Um, our kids have become less accountable. So having a zero as a possibility if you don't hand in any work is balanced. The new grading policy is effective immediately for everyone except high school credit-bearing classes. It goes into effect for them next year. We're told grades will be on a 100-point scale, the lowest grade possible, 50% for students who turn in assignments. Keisha, thank you. And that brings us to our Fox 5 Instapol question tonight. Should students get a zero for not turning in those assignments almost 96 percent of you in fact say yes just four percent of you say no hmm. you can still weigh in on this uh controversial topic here let us know what you think scan that qr code there on your screen head to fox5dc.com or vote in the fox 5 news app interesting